To mark Sea Sunday, this short video explores the very valuable work of the Apostleship of the Sea. This is the Humber Estuary, and like so many waterways across the world, a haven for modern maritime activity. Covering 65 hectares, the Port of Hull is an extensive network of docks serving the shipping industry, and like some 300 others across the world, it is a base for the work of the Apostleship of the Sea serving the thousands of seafarers who make fleeting visits to these shores. Entry to a modern port is a daunting experience for any visitor, a dangerous workplace with the necessary security responding to the threat of our time. But how more daunting is it when you've been away from home for months on end, speak limited English, have no local knowledge, and only a few hours before returning to the sea? These are the challenges facing seafarers, and these are the reasons the Apostleship of the Sea invests so heavily in visiting seafarers where they are on board. The movement of goods makes the world economy work, but it is the seafarers who make the movement of goods possible. These are the men and women who are most vulnerable and deserve a little support to make their lives more bearable. How long will you be when you go home? How long will you, time will you have when you go home? How many weeks? Uh, about uh, two months or three months before three months. the holiday. Yeah, yeah. And how long have you been a cook on board the container? Already ten, ten years. Ten years, right. So do you have wife and family in Indonesia? Yeah? Yeah. And how many children do you have? I have uh, three children. Three children? One son and two daughters. And how old are they? The old one in the 16 years. 16, yeah. And second, uh, around the 11 years. 11. And the last one in the, the two years. Two years. So how do you keep in contact with your family when you're on board the ship? What kind of communication do you use? Communication is what the only use the internet. Internet, yeah. <clears throat> and then the, sometimes I call him by telephone, directly telephone, I mean. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, I, sometimes I use the video calling. Video, Skyping. Skyping, Skyping yeah. Skyping or Messenger or something. Messenger, yeah, yeah, something yeah. like that. Yeah. Messenger's very good, yeah. isn't it? So how often do you get to speak to your family when you're in the week? Do you speak to them every day or...? Not every day. Not every day, no. But do you miss them when you're away? <laughs> when you're away for six months? Do you miss them? Yeah, I miss yeah. them. But, uh, I think yeah, I can use it like that. Said, uh, make a video calling. And yeah. So video calling is very important. It's very important. Because you can see their face, yes, can't you? Yes, yes. And it's much better. I have a son yeah. that works abroad, yeah. and you can speak to them on the phone. Uh -huh, yeah. But when you see somebody's face, it's much better. Yes, isn't sir. It? they're very happy. So you can see if they're happy or sad, yeah. or if they're pleased to hear from you, which is good, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes there isn't internet on board ships, and I think probably a lot of the time there isn't, is there? There's no free internet, so what we can do for you is provide MyFi units. Now they are a device that allows you and a number of other seafarers on the ship to connect to the internet and it's free. So the next time that you come in, mm -hmm. if you'd like to borrow it, you can give me a call and we can leave it on board and you'll be able to contact your family. Because uh -huh. I know it's important that you really keep nice. communication up. And we'll be able to let you do that. What a day. That's brilliant. Well <laughs> done. Very good. <laughs> Can you tell me how long you you're, uh, have been on board the ship? Uh, now almost six months. Six months? Almost yeah. Six months. Okay. And what's your job on board? Me prepare for the rope, yeah. uh, working daily and preparing for cargo, mm -hmm. put the twist lock and the same thing like that. So how long have you been seafarer? For now, I mm, two years. Now. Two years now. Yeah, yeah. Two contract. Two contracts. Yeah. yeah. Now six months. But six months. Yeah. My son works abroad okay. and we have get texts on messenger yeah, and everything every day like that. I get, 
so I can like he just tells me I'm here, I'm here, and then right. it's really yeah, nice yeah. just to have that reassuring, yeah, yeah, yeah. isn't it? It kind of keeps you going, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We can help more guys like you. So if you need anything, you know where we are. Yeah, yeah. We can come on board and just be yeah. listening in. Okay. Okay. Good. All right then. See you soon. In addition to visiting ships, the Apostleship of the Sea has seafarers centres with facilities to offer a little home from home. Access to Wi-Fi connects seafarers across the miles and enables that significant contact with their families and loved ones. Each year, the Apostleship of the Sea visits more than 70,000 ships around the world. That's more than a million encounters with individual seafarers helping them to be in touch with their family, helping them to share needs and concerns with our port chaplains so that they can continue to work safely aboard the vessels they serve on. The Sea Sunday Collection is your opportunity to make a real difference to the lives of seafarers. Please also keep the Apostleship of the Sea in your prayers and consider leaving them a gift in your will. Your gift in this collection will make a real difference. Five pounds can buy a phone card for a seafarer to contact his family back home. Ten pounds can provide faith resources such as Bibles, crosses or faith development courses for a ship's crew. Fifty pounds will pay for enough fuel for a chaplain to visit 12 ships and support nearly 250 seafarers. If you are a taxpayer, please complete one of the gift aid envelopes to make this collection go a little further. Last year, the extra tax from the gift aid enabled the Apostleship of the Sea to visit 500 ships, helping some 10,000 seafarers. Thank you for your interest, and may God bless your generosity.